So before we get into it, yeah. um, some of the questions that we actually got on the last video, one of them was, should they touch the bar on their chest? I've always thought, yes, 100%. Like, that's a full range rep down to your chest before you press up. What's your take on it? I agree. Um, now, I also base my standard off of like a powerlifting meet. Yeah. And that's a proper rep. Oh yeah, of course. Um, and there's even a pause with the powerlifting. Exactly. Right? Yeah. How long is that pause? It's short, yeah. but it is a pause. They want to make sure there's no momentum. Yeah. So what we be doing, what yeah. we're doing typically yeah. is, is touch and go. Yeah. Which there's meets for that. Yeah. But the ones that count count is yeah. the, the slight it's, pause and go. And, then you and if we was training for a meet, then yeah. that's how we'll be that's doing, how we our, doing our, our sets. Sure. From the comments, I saw some people have been told that it's actually harder if they don't touch their chest. Which for me, I can see that though. I can see it, but, but for me, a full range rep is touch your chest, you press up, man. You gotta think about this. Harder in a sense that it's kind of like in a dead stop in the yeah. middle, but yeah. Yeah. full range is, is more range. Yeah. It, that's, if that's you want to inherently. It, full range is always gonna be better work. if you wanna build that, that, that muscle. Man. It's more work. Yeah. If you can go down, I would say go down. Yeah. But, but the argument that it's harder not touching your chest, I don't really buy that. One thing I seen consistently in comments though, yeah. was they was like, yo, y'all like y'all having fun. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> and of I'm, course, man. That's how it should be, honestly, guys. Look, you should enjoy it. Like these guys that go to the golf court golf course with their buds and they have yeah. a ball. Yeah. This is the same for me. You know what I'm saying? But we get more out of it, I think. Always right? said that training is just fun. It for should me. be fun. It always, yeah. Fresh, fresh. The new? <laughs> yeah. Y'all gotta get the drip down there. I got a collection, gotta, man. Y'all gotta show that, man. That's another thing we, we tend to do in the gym is stay kind of fresh. Even if it's subtle, we gotta stay fresh. <laughs> the temperature right now is reminding me of Metroflex days. So um, obviously you guys that have followed me for a long time will know that I used to train at Metroflex in the UK. And uh, let's just say there was always issues with the heating. There'll be condensation as you're breathing because it's so cold. But well, right now the temperature's dropped in LA. It's quite cold. Hello. Yes, please. Oh, come on, Sim. What goes through your head on a heavy ass lift like this? This actual particular lift, I was hoping for two. Sometimes I hype myself too, up too quickly and I take the bar off when I wasn't even ready. Like that one, I took it off too, too soon 
I count. I even count. I did the count. You okay. know, I was like three, two, one, bam. Right, right, right. But I wasn't. I wasn't. I wasn't ready yet. So as soon as it came off, got to work. <laughs> Had to right, do the rest. Right. But if I had given myself some time, I could have just made sure I was in the right position and right. frame of mind to try and go for that two. See here, I didn't hit the that particular rep. Um, Sim grabbed it, but I had it. But it doesn't matter. Uh, sometimes with me, if y'all know, my first rep is shady as hell. That's just how it is. You know what I'm saying? I move real slow, which is really wasting a lot of energy. But you know, I've had injuries before on the bench, so it's it's psychological in my mind. I'm just like moving real slow. You know what I mean? So. One, two, one. Come on. Come on. Easy money. Come on. That's what I wanted to do, man. That's what I wanted to do. So basically, with my last set with the 425, I wasn't happy with it because, like I said, I, didn't, I wasn't prepared and then it just flew down and I got it up. But so this one, I wanted to pause rep on it, make sure I had it. Bam. Let me know that the strength's there. That's the proper rep. That's when you know you got it. Yeah. You got it. Hey, let's get it, baby. Down so y'all can hear my pain. <laughs> <and> my <laughs> yep. 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 Up, up, up. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. Up. There you go. Easy. Easy. Nah, that was easy, man. It was moving smooth. Guys, when you friggin' have hit the heavier weights, weight like this that's supposed to, be, supposed to feel heavy really doesn't, man. Like, you take it off and it's gonna feel like two plates now. Up, down, up, down. Hey! Come on. And again, and again. 
Yep. Woo. Dope set. Dope set. Dope set. Was that 14 or 15? 14. Guys, what we're going to do, because I think I did 13, and I think Mike did 14. We're going to, I'm going to do one rep, we're going to edit it in. Uh, <laughs> edit that in. Two more reps than Mike. Dumps it, man. <laughs> Yo, we're done. So again, today, just bringing you the bench press exercise. Another great freaking chest session in the bag. You guys were loving the last one. And uh, there was a lot of good questions on there that hopefully I've answered in the comments and in this video. If you have further questions, make sure you just throw them out because I will try and answer them either responding in the YouTube comments or on the video, like right now. So um, yeah, make sure you send those questions in. Yeah, dope session. I mean, earlier on, I, I, I tell you, I wasn't feeling the greatest. I was feeling, I was feeling tired. Plus, it was cold in there, man. So, getting my joints warm was taking a while. But when you got to the 425 and you saw what happened there, where it flew up, but it wasn't a controlled rep. So, the next set, I wanted to take control again. <laughs> so, that's why I only did the run rep, but I made it a pause rep. So, I just wanted to take control, get back into my stride. Next set, we repped out on four plates. Then we did the pause reps on 365. Yeah, I was in that zone of just control, wanting to control it. A lot of you guys are really funny, man. Sometimes you, you get things twisted and I sometimes see comments, oh, oh it's, it's, it's bouncing or it's this, it's that. Like, don't worry, man, about what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing, you know? And there's a, there's a method. There's always a method to, to, to what may appear like madness. And then we repped out on three plates. I still haven't even counted how many I got. I think it was 13, which unfortunately isn't a PR on that weight. You know, I've hit 13 before. I was hoping for 14. Started to feel like cardio at one point where it was just about getting the breathing right. And this wasn't really about the strength, but um, we'll see, we'll count it up. And uh, if, if it isn't like past 13, I did an extra two reps that Evan's gonna edit in so that I can do more than Mike. <laughs> Peace out guys, subscribe, easy.